The film opens in media's res where street fighting issues are raised in Mumbai. Sports chairman Peter Braganzer expresses his desire of making street fighting a legal sport and decides to open a league called Right to Fight. R. Do F. Meanwhile, imprisoned Garson, Gary, Fernandez, a recovering alcoholic and former MMA expert under rehabilitation, is released from his jail term. And his younger son Monty comes to pick him up. Monty gets tensed when his father asks about his elder son David and takes him away to their home. At home, Gary acts protective of all the belongings of his wife, Maria, who died many years ago. David, now a physics teacher, has a daughter with a kidney ailment. Unable to arrange money from the bank and other sources, he starts to earn money through street fights. As he was once a promising MMA fighter when he was younger. This stresses out his wife, Jenny, as she is worried about David. Meanwhile, Gary, who misses his wife Maria, starts hallucinating about her and violently attacks a mirror from self-hating about how he destroyed his family. Monty rushes to stop and comfort his father, realizing how much regret he has. Gary then tries to meet David. But the latter ends up throwing Monty and Gary out of his house in a rage after Gary sees his granddaughter and learns David named her after his mother, Maria, Uddharan. Over a flashback, Monty is revealed to be Gary's illegitimate child. Maria nevertheless loved Monty, as she did David. The two brothers had a close loving relationship until David was 23 and Monty was 15. On the night of Monty's 15th birthday, Gary came home drunk and apologized to Maria for destroying the family, but mentioned his lover Sarah's name instead of Maria's. An enraged Maria confronted Gary about this, and in a drunken state, Gary hit Maria, who was injured from hitting her head on the furniture and died. A furious David pushed Gary aside. When Monty came close to Maria, who reached out to him before passing, David angrily pushed him away, holding his father and half-brother equally responsible for his mother's death. This is what created the rift between Gary, Monty, and David. David later loses his job in school when Principal Shobhit Desai learns about David's involvement. In street fights, Monty, who wants to be a fighter, is then introduced to Suleiman Pasha, a fighting agent who is old friends with Gary. As they trained together, Suleiman fixes a match with Mustafa in which Monty is defeated. This enrages Gary, but Monty asks for a rematch with Mustafa, where Monty brutally defeats Mustafa after listening to his father's advice and is declared a Selected fighter for R. Do F. by Peter. The fight is recorded and uploaded to YouTube. And soon Monty becomes an internet sensation. Monty undergoes training to become the R. Do F. champion. Meanwhile, David, too, decides to be a full-time fighter. And Jenny encourages him to do so. Suleiman is initially unconvinced by David but arranges a match while Monty celebrates his victory. At a bar, David is soon victorious in the fight and is accepted for Ardo F after convincing Suleiman of his true potential. Ardo F begins its grand debut and soon becomes a sensation as fighters from all over the world show their interest in the league. Monty easily defeats his opponents till he goes up against Luca, a fighter who is notorious for brutally knocking out his opponents. Gama and Potter but manages to knock him out, shocking the audience as he becomes the first finalist. Meanwhile, David the underdog comes up with a robust game plan to outlast his opponents, Ronnie and Tenzin, to reach the semis. There, he fights Hammer, an aggressive fighter who kicks the cage, injuring Gary. This leads to David going in all-out attack mode to violently assault Hammer in retaliation. And he too advances to the finale. After beating their last opponents the brothers are now the finalists in their identities as 
Siblings are revealed to the public causing massive media coverage for the R2F. Gary. Feeling guilty about his sons fighting each other instead of loving one another because of his mistake. Leaves the arena. Jenny. David's students. Principal. And everyone back at Suleiman's fight club watch the match. Which becomes brutal from the heated rivalry between the brothers. Monty proves dominant in striking and throws in cheap shots to taunt David. Gary heads back to the arena when he sees the fight. During the fight, David breaks Monty's shoulder, which causes David concern as Monty refuses to give up. Gary rushes towards the cage and apologizes for his mistakes, and tells David not to direct his anger towards his brother. Monty continues to fight despite David's plea to stop. David gets Monty in a rear naked chokehold and tells Monty not to fight anymore. Monty, in turn, tells David to continue to choke him because David is selfish and never considered how Monty felt. That night, telling him Maria was also his mother and how lonely he was without her and David in his life. David moved to tears. Now realizing how much pain he caused to his brother finally apologizes. And Monty allows David to win the championship. David takes Monty in his arms. And both brothers walk backstage. Now having finally reconciled. 